You need a robot to learn robotics engineer. And let's say you have built one similar to the one that we are going to utilize in this video. The very next step that you have to perform is localization for an indoor mobile robotics. Why? Because without localization of your robot, you cannot perform slam, you cannot perform motion planning, navigation, or any algorithm that is depending upon the pose of the robot. That's why we are going to understand what are the basic steps to know your robot's location, kinematics, odometry, and these kind of equations that we use for daily basis for a robot. Let's find out. Here is the robot that we will be utilizing for this understanding. There are a lot of components of this robot, but before moving forward, make sure you have a physical robot so you can write code from the equations that we will derive. On this robot, you can observe a microcontroller, an IMU, the display, and motor driver. These are the electronic components. Then there is a battery and motors with wheels. On the motors, you can observe encoders with magnet. So what we do, we turn on the robot with a button and everything lights up. The wheel starts to move. The basic code is to move forward. The thing that we have to do is when these wheels are rotating, we have to convert these rotations into distance in X and Y. This is the thing that we are going to be doing through equations. 